My name is Susan Wang Selfridge. I lived in Los Angeles, California for 30 years. I am a music educator and a proud Tai Chi Man Dizi under the tutelage of the Grandmaster Dr. Hong for 15 years at the Tai Chi Man Qigong Academy, Los Angeles branch. My Shifu Dr. Hong taught me many things and one of them that I abide by as an educator and as a human being is to be able to tell right from wrong, true from false, and good from bad. Most importantly, courageously admit my own mistakes and willingly make corrections. This is not at all the first time I have spoken out about the ordeal Tai Chi Man and its members have been through for the past 24 years with such unjust, illegal treatment by a handful of Taiwan governmental and national revenue service officials. Tai Chi Man is an ancient Qigong martial arts and self-cultivation institution and it fosters a very precious Shifu and Di Zhi relationship with the purpose of cultivating the humanity. In following ancient tradition, these will prepare monetary gifts as a token to show our respect and appreciation to the master who passes to us invaluable wisdom and guidance. Tai Chi Man is classified as a spiritual enrichment institution, which by law is a nonprofit and tax-free organization. All the monetary gifts that Dr. Hong receives as a grandmaster is tax-free under taxation laws. However, the Taiwan Taxation Bureau purposefully ignored the ruling of the court, has schemed to engage in illegal enforcement activities by auctioning off Tai Chi Man's real estate by the end of July 2020. I want to once again condemn the severe violation of human rights of the Taiwanese government and demand immediate action to correct this unjust behavior. I will also inform my state and federal senators as a U.S. citizen who has been mistreated by this human rights violation.